Latino de Chupa de Ameriki. Good evening and a warm welcome to the stadium. It's John Champion alongside Mark Lawrence and we are live right across the nation for this much anticipated match. The floodlights on, there's a special atmosphere and kickoff is imminent. If you ask any footballer when he would rather play, in the afternoon or at night, it will always be at night. There's something different about these games. Just listen to those fans. The incredible atmosphere here is perfect for this final in which the true champions will be decided. I have to admit, the scoreline is slightly flattering. They're just not on form. They seem to be playing a very restricted game and not using the space available. Well, we hope it's not going to be the final. He did superbly. To make the header, cleaning off his mark and planting the ball so forcefully into the net, giving the keeper absolutely no chance. That's his second in this competition. And you can sense that he's starting to find a bit of form. Where? This way. Come on. What a great chance it's a long way out to be having a go direct. The save it is a yellow card. No hard feelings between the two players. But there was an air of cynicism about the foul. And they have won the American Cup. This is their day, their season, and a title to savour for years to come. Their domination throughout the campaign has made them deserve champions in anybody's books. I reckon for players, these games are always difficult to deal with. You sit down there with the manager before the game, and he says, look boys, you know the deal, you win this game, you're the champion. Well, they've done that. They've won the game, and they are, quite rightly, the champions, and they deserve it. I feel this is a little bit of a strange time, you know. You've worked so hard, you are the champions, you've won the game, and you kind of look at each other saying, well, what do we do now? Yeah, you kiss each other and you hug each other, but it probably doesn't sink in until the next few days. That's all we have time for this evening. So many thanks to Mark Lawrence.